prefer easel painting, like that traditional easel painting. Um, I usually start with an imprimatura. Um, that's, that's just like toning the surface. I usually use like a dark and like neutral color. Um, and then from there, I'll actually start rubbing away the paint, like actually removing some of the paint. And that kind of like gives it like a lighter value. Um, and so from there, I can kind of see like what shapes am I seeing? I can start bringing out the forms of like what I'm trying to get in the composition. Um, and so I kind of just sit with that for a second, let it dry, see how I feel about it. Um, and once that's kind of done, like that underpainting's done, um, I'll really think about like what colors I want to use. And I try and select like a pretty limited palette. Um, I, I love colors and I could easily use like the whole rainbow and spectrum. And so I usually limit myself um, with just a few um, to see how far I can push those specific colors. So uh, once I have the underpainting's done, I have my colors picked out. I usually use very thin layers of acrylic paint, like almost like a wash. And I'll build up several layers of this thin paint um, to bring up like the vibrancy of the colors that I'm using. I definitely think often about the expressive powers of colors, how we associate like certain emotions with them when we like when we see them. And so I'm really paying attention um, to different color harmonies um, and distances, like color harmonies and color distances. I'm trying to pull out different emotive qualities in my work. I I would I would definitely say so. Um, I guess. One thing I think about when I'm painting is I'm kind of exploring the questions I have about myself and the world. Um, and I definitely feel like Judaism and the Jewish culture definitely places an emphasis in like education and learning. And I think growing up Jewish has kind of fostered um, like my curiosity and like how I'm asking questions. Um, so I definitely say it plays a big part. For Tzvayim, I am exhibiting my piece Searching. Um, this painting is actually from a series I'm working on called If Not Now, When. Uh, where I'm using the expressive powers of colors and the symbolic quality of hands in an interpretive dance to explore identity and my relationship to Judaism in the contemporary world.